Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. So we're back on uh, a lot of our wintertime maintenance tips. Here's another good one. If you've got uh, big blue lorapi or variegated lorapi or really just lorapi of any sorts, a lot of times you'll see them, they'll be used as like a bed border. Uh, this happens to be a pretty thick bed border. Sometimes you can just have little individual clumps. Uh, we'll show you an example of that. There's a multitude of different examples you can have. However, right now in the winter time is when you want to trim it. So all summer and spring and all, it's going to grow and it gets thick and it'll get to be, you know, 10 to 12, maybe in a little bit taller, inches tall. And then it starts getting kind of weak and lazy and see how it starts to lay down and it kind of mats. What you need to do is you need to trim it. It's actually very easy. You can use your weed eater. You can use some of the little hand shears, whatever. You just need to trim it down to it's about three or four inches tall. What this is going to do is it's going to make it get thicker. It's going to make it get healthier. Uh, it's going to fix how it lays down and starts looking all messy. Now the spring, it's going to grow. It's going to stand up right. You're going to get your little bitty purple flowers. Uh, you're going to see the little seed pods. Everything's going to look better. So again, just because it's winter time doesn't mean there's not maintenance that needs to happen. Big blue lorapi, variegated lorapi, any of your lorapis, they need to be trimmed right now. Uh, here we are in February. So it's usually it's a January, February uh, task. If you have any questions, let me know. Y'all have a good day.